What is going on guys? Welcome back. Another commentary for you tonight. Do me a favor, take a moment, hit that like button, subscribe button, criticism in the comment section, Twitter, shutdown safety is my username. Taking a look at it, the beloved Madden Ambulance. And when I think back to the ambulance, to me, I didn't mind that it was there. I didn't make the connection that someone got hurt or anything along those lines. But it's ironic that I thought about how poorly it was done. When most of us think of the ambulance, truthfully, we think about it just plowing through players onto the field with zero regard that it was running over the same players it would later come out to try to assist. And I think that's what endeared it to most of us was the comedic aspect of it. But if we really think about it, way back then, weren't we just laying the framework for accepting this subpar product and laughing it off along the way. I mean, if you take this and you correlate it to little miniature players or the great big players that we just laugh off as a joke. I mean, it's doing something and doing it the right way. And so many of my Madden videos seem to boil down to that logic. If you're going to have an ambulance come on the field, have an ambulance come on the field to help the player. Don't have it run over the injured player, and in this case, five others, as it peels off the field, never slowing down. And to me, when I go back and I think about that, it just seems like there's ways that it could have been done better, where someone could have said, hey, wait a second, we're not going to put this ambulance on the field to run people over if it's there to get somebody off the field. Have it go up and down the screen, that way it doesn't run anyone over, instead of just driving through the middle of the field. I mean, reality, when was the last time you saw an ambulance that went on to an NFL field drive through the middle of the field? It doesn't even happen. They're not driving through the line of scrimmage, for God's sake. This quote here, though, very important. This is a quote used when EA was defining why they had to not include the ambulance anymore. Quote, they did not want to see a player strapped to a backboard motionless, says the second producer. Quote, that was a hard restriction given to us in the mid-2000s. If a guy was carted off the field, he had to be moving around, not paralyzed. The problem I have with a lot of the things EA does is the rationale they use to excuse someone else telling them why they can't. The NFL is telling them they can't do this. Any other job, any job I've had, if someone gave me a challenge in the way of my objective, I had to become a problem solver and overcome that. I couldn't just say, well, you wanted me to do this as my boss, but somebody else came to me and told me there was a reason I couldn't do it, so <laughs> I just can't do it. That doesn't work in the real world. Now, I understand you never would want to do something to damage the relationship or agreement you have with the NFL, but even in that quote there, it gives a lot of different options. Why does someone automatically have to be injured to the point that are strapped to a backboard motionless? Why can't they have a trainer come out and help them? Why can't they have the cart come out and help them? Wasn't 2K5 made in the 2000s? Didn't they have the same restrictions by the NFL that EA did? Didn't they have the cart that came out onto the field and, yes, comically popped into gear like it was going to do a wheelie as soon as the player got on? Why couldn't they have taken that challenge and found a way to make the game better instead of just excluding it? The same way they couldn't have taken the initial challenge of putting an ambulance on a field without having it run over half the team. I think when I look at what EA does compared to other game developers, I see a company that more and more and more has a legacy of just accepting the way things should be broken and not trying to find ways to creatively work past them against competitors that welcome challenges, welcome suggestions from the community, and truthfully, want to make a better product based on we want in our hands. As a side note, EA sold this ambulance on a t-shirt, so it's not like they weren't aware that people wanted it in the game. And as far as I'm concerned, even reading the quote from what they say about the NFL, 
there's no excuse we couldn't have a better representation of medical professionals in the NFL in our NFL game. Apart from just a quote that says, hey, we only knew one way to do it, and if we can't do it that way, we're not going to do it at all. Well, you know what? As a consumer, I demand a little bit better. And if I don't get it, I'm here to talk to you guys about it. And you know what that said, I'll be back in the week with more comments.